Senate. Las Vegas remembers Tony Shea, the former chief executive of Zappos, who died of injuries sustained from a house fire. Zappos is an online shoe and clothing retailer based in the city. Eagle News correspondent Lori Jarvina joins us tonight with the story. Lori? Thank you, Anna. On Friday, Nevada Governor Steve Sisolak posted a tribute to the visionary and entrepreneur Tony Shea and condolences to his family, stating that Tony Shea played a pivotal role in helping transform downtown Las Vegas. According to reports, Tony Shea, the co-founder of Zappos online shoe company, died at age 46 in Connecticut. Last night, Shea was honored on the LED screens of Fremont Street Experience's Viva Vision video canopy, organized and hosted by the co-owner of the Circa Hotel in downtown Las Vegas. Shea's history with Las Vegas began in 2004, when he moved the Zappos headquarters from the Bay Area to Las Vegas in order to better build its customer service operations. In fact, he felt so strongly for customer service that he gave employees the latitude to ensure customer satisfaction to the best of their abilities. Then in 2009, he sold Zappos to Amazon for $1.2 billion and continued to run the company for over 21 years, only recently stepping down earlier this year in August. Tony Shea used some proceeds from the sale to spearhead the downtown project, amounting to $350 million in investments devoted to rebuild and rejuvenate downtown Las Vegas. Shea's project was focused on urban regeneration, building up the community culture with emphasis on improving the quality of life of downtown residents. His vision was a community with thriving businesses that mutually supported each other. Tony Shea was known for his generosity, sincere kindness, and relentless efforts to create a positive environment for his employees and the city as a whole. Downtown Las Vegas continues to move towards realizing Shea's vision. In Las Vegas, Nevada, Lori Jarvina, Eagle News, we live in interesting times. Back to you, Anna. Thank you, Lori, for your report. Uh, yes, absolutely, he will surely be missed here in Las Vegas. Now, what about, what are your thoughts about downtown Las Vegas? Well, you know, since moving to Vegas, uh, most of our time here has been under the restrictions of COVID. Um, but when we have been able to get out and about a little bit, uh, we can see there's a difference between the Strip and Las Vegas downtown. And, uh, you know, Tony Shea's vision to create a community for the locals of Las Vegas in the downtown area uh, looks to be coming to a realization. So we look forward to that. Um, and being able to explore more and really be part of the community of Las Vegas. Well, Lori, you do you have to check out the Container Park when it's the when it's safer to go out there. <laughs>